Caster, and welcome to Customer Success Stories. Today, I have with me Rachel Luoma from what we call NBC Dental. Uh, Rachel, tell a little, a little about yourself and your organization. So I work, um, the certification group that I work with is the National Board for Certification in Dental Laboratory Technology. Uh, I actually work with multiple organizations and associations here at my association management company, which is Partners in Association Mar Management. Um, but my work with Monitor EDU is with our certification board, uh, as you say, NBC Dental. Yeah, NBC. And so that is certifying uh, dental technicians. Those are the people who manufacture crowns, bridges, dentures, um, and things that go in a patient's mouth. Perfect. Yeah, as I understand, well, not as I understand, you, dip, you work with us in two ways, one on your written exams, but also the practical exams. And that's yes. really the one I wanted to talk to you about today, talk to you with today. So um, yeah. anyway, so I'm stumbling here. No worries. The editing <laughs> software is an amazing thing. It is amazing. <laughs> um, so when you first... Uh, partnered with Monitor to you, what problem were you trying to solve with the practical exams? Yeah, well, I mean, I know from our perspective as a national certification organization that, you know, we have constituents all across the country. And so um, for us, you know, we were offering practical examinations in volunteer host sites. Um, and that became problematic because we were dealing with, um, you know, the unknown in terms of travel costs and um, you know, hotel and lodging. And um, then the other thing was that because people were testing not in their own dental laboratories, they were testing in other dental laboratories, you know, we were finding that there were a lot of challenges for our candidates as well. Um, so we weren't necessarily, you know, fully able to test, you know, their knowledge, skills and abilities. We were able to test their knowledge, skills and abilities in, you know, a foreign location. And so we were really trying to eliminate some of the barriers for people to be able to become certified. Great. It, we started the project before the pandemic. So this was a pre-pandemic project, but it was something that was entirely new that we hadn't really done before. Oh so, yeah. So tell me about the beginning and some of the things that, that we've learned over the, over the four years, four years or so that we've been doing this. Yeah. I mean, what's really crazy is when we first started talking about this concept, um, you know, we didn't even realize that it was possible. And, you know, through the use of your technology and really what we're calling, you know, the dual camera process, um, it's really opened the door for our folks to be able to test. And so, you know, really what we were just trying to figure out is logistically, how, how can you make this work? Um, and that's where you guys came on board and we were connected with you. Um, and what, what's really awesome is like, when we ever we had a problem, we weren't the only ones who were working towards a solution. You were helping us to brainstorm that solution. And that partnership, I think for us was extremely valuable because had we not been connected with you, I just don't think we'd be as far into the process as we are now. And it, I don't think it would be as successful as, as it is now. Now, one of the challenges we faced was our proctors know almost nothing about being a digital yeah. lab technician. And they, have, <laughs> yeah, and they have to interact with the technician. So how did how did we solve that problem? Well, I think, you know, like for us, um, you know, planning is very critical. And so, you know, you guys are the subject matter experts on proctoring and really the testing process and we're the experts on the industry. And so we really had to collaborate quite a bit to make sure that we had that shared knowledge. You know, so like we worked together to develop a 13 page proctor manual, if you will, to be able to give your proctors the tools that they need to successfully proctor the examinations. Now, you obviously in turn took that information and then put it in a really user friendly, um, you know, platform for your team members to be able to do that. But I think we really had to do that together. Um, you know, and so that's really how we were able to do that. We sent you pictures of things. We sent you screenshots of things. You know, we almost wrote scripts, yeah. if you will. Um, and uh, I think one of the things we realized quickly is, you know, uh, especially with, you know, not us not having that common language, like we know dental laboratory technology and you're stumbling over certain words. Um, you know, we figured quickly that if we used, uh, you know, a certain platform where you could show that on the screen, then your proctors didn't have to read that to the candidates. The candidates could just read that information and we could leave it on the screen so they could come back to it. And so um, we almost created, I think, if you call it like a playbook, you yeah. know, for your proctors to be able to successfully administer, you know, a five hour plus examination for candidates, um, you know, with little to no interruption in their ability to follow along. Great. 
Um, so just to try to lighten things up a little bit, now that you work a lot with different dental technicians, how does that make you feel when you go to the dentist? So I feel fine. I mean, I've always felt fine. My dad was a dentist. Uh, so growing up, I grew up in dentistry. And so and, and now we can actually like talk about dentistry together. He's very excited that I'm in, you know, in the industry. Um, you know, he's even like asked me for like advice on certain things. I was like, this is such a role reversal. So yeah, I like going to the dentist. I just, we were there this morning. So that's great. Yeah. I, I too have learned a lot about dentistry during this. Process. Right. So, anyways, yeah. Rachel, thank you very much. Uh, this was enjoyable to meet with you and it's been great working with you. Um, yeah. Thanks. Thank you. The feeling is mutual. We've really enjoyed our partnership and, you know, we really think that it's done great things for the profession and for our certification program. And so we're, we're just so appreciative. Excellent.